Welcome to the Magic Darts Masters, event number 10 on the 2023 Championship Dart Circuit. I, you know, it's you got two powerhouses here. You know, you got the history in favor of Stowe as Stowe looks to light up the, the ones to get started. But, you know, and you got Gates, like you said, coming off a of three-peat of the seniors. And then, you know, the brand-new sponsorship here 96. with uh, Winmore. But I just – I feel like he – Stowe's on fire. Like, the guy's just – doing it he's just doing what he needs to 83. do well, i don't know if you saw that dpfl finish that stowe had the other day where he went 180 on 186 to leave six and then he went double one double one double one to take out the match and defeat robbie 95. phillips so he was flat out feeling himself to say the least because that's that is ego personified right there <laughs> which stowe does not actually have no he so doesn't no. for him to throw that way is is his confidence in his game yeah that's that's bonkers that takes your tops tops to a whole nother level yes it does <laughs> that that blows the jose de souza right out the gate yeah no pun intended the other question we have is, and I know, and I know it's gotten better, and I know, but someone's going to talk about it somewhere. Is Gates and, and Gates and mathing himself down? Ninety-one. You know, does he's he, gotten a lot better. He has gotten a lot better. Yeah. I'm not insulting. I'm not saying he still has a big problem with it, but I'm saying it still has happened on rare occasion. One hundred and thirty-three. That being said, I also Lenny do think the 40. soldier, his scoring power, is probably a little more efficient than than Stowe. But, Typically. But Stowe, like I said, he's just, he's been finding his way, you know. And like you say, to go 180 and then go double, Miss double, double Stowe, is you require 81. kind of bananas and a potential way to steal a leg here. Well, look at that. The dude himself, Jeff Good, is our board official for this one as Stowe misses the big number twice. 34. Leonard, you require 40. So tops here for Leonard to break the throw right away. Leonard in this tournament is only averaging 79.44 to Stowe's 86.13. Second leg, Leonard to throw first. But Gates looked good there. Because then my next question, too, is has Leonard moved on to the barrel? Or is he still throwing the old one with the sponsorship change? So how familiar? Of course, if he did, he won senior. 180. So. Well, there is the scoring power for Leonard Gates. And you're seeing Stowe Bunce do what made him famous in weekend number three, and that's shoot a lot of 19s and be very impressive on them. Hey, it's about getting down low and getting to the zero. It's not a, how you get there is, you know, a journey only you pick. So, 125. Stowe Bunce from Virginia. Leonard Gates from Houston, Texas. I also think you couldn't have gotten a more. Uh, 55. Uh, lights on, lights off approach here with you know Leonard. The color coordination. The color coordination and and personality. Like Leonard is very 42. stoic and calm and inner and you know faces inward, and Stowe is more emotion on the sleeve, bright colors, bright personality. He just stabbed himself there with the yeah, dart. Well, you know, every once in a while you got to poke yourself to remind you you bleed and you're human. Leonard, you require 150. Well, this is definitely an off leg for him. Through nine darts, he's still at 359. Leonard has a lot of time on his hands to take up this 1-5-4, even if he does those things. Great last dart. That's the best way to hit 68 when the last dart hits the treble. 60. Leonard, you require eight. As we look around the room here, Jim Long, JT Davis, 5-5 five to five in a last leg decider currently. Oh, wow. Leonard goes for the bull. 61. And he does that because he hits that bullseye more often than he misses it. Do you still believe he holds the world record for bulls hit consecutively? So, the man like the bull. 164. Big 164 from Stowe to put a little pressure on the 120 or on the 25, not the 125. It's going to be double eight. Game and he shot, gets third it. Third dart, second leg, two legs to zero. Leonard. Holds the throw. Third leg, Stowe to throw first. Stowe only averaging 74 and a half. You can imagine that's going to go up as the match goes on. But he's hitting a lot of neighbors 85. right now. And that 
being said, JT Davis just took down Jim Long. Wow, what an important match. 180. As Leonard Gates, another 180. That's his second one of the match. The scoring power is definitely alive right now for Leonard. 57. Yeah, Stowe leads Gates and Legs on the CDC 24 59. to 11. And I'm pretty sure that Leonard is the type of player who knows that. Oh, yeah. I always, I always uh, envision Gates as being the kind of guy who's kind of always got a mental, a mental checklist in his mind. You know what I mean? You know, I remember this one time this happened, or you know, this has been the way this has always been. And it's time to change it. Well, Leonard trips up there, opening up the door here for Stowe. So with that being said, JT beats Jim Long, Ryan Vanderwhite beats Jacob Taylor. So now JT and Ryan will find each other. And we'll have Alex and Danny. Yep. 59. And David Cameron waits. He's waiting on the winner of Jake McMillan versus John Lidget. Jake McMillan right now up 5-2. to two. Jake, another one of those players that's on the outside looking in. Yeah. Captain Canada, 85. who played in the U.S. Darts Masters. Yep. He's in the 21st spot on the CDC 2023 Tours point list. Still will return with the 121, but Leonard put some pressure there to leave 60. This yeah. almost has to go. It, it has to go. And it will not. 97. In case Gates miss, he'll be right back, though. Tops for Gates. And he Gage takes a 3-0 lead. lead. And that's Fourth two breaks a throw, throw on Stowe Bunce. And Stowe is not happy right now with the way he's throwing. 60. Soldier showing, showing us a second way to get 60. Mm -hmm. It's weird. He finds a second way to get 60, and I find all the ways to get 43. 67. It's weird. Of a bobble, the dart recollects. 100. Finds it. Stowe's got to start hitting troubles, big troubles, not the little ones. 34. 33, excuse me. This is not the Stowe Bunts we have seen in the CDC. No. Not at all. We'll see if he can start to find it. I mean, he's just wiring them if he, and still not hitting the troubles. He's there. He's just not in. Meanwhile, 85. Leonard Gates continuing to just pepper the board. Do what he has done on the senior tour overseas, 58. and that is get in control and stay in control. It's a pretty devastating thought process as an opponent when you're the guy you're playing is always 97. consistently going up there and putting up, you know, 80 plus, 90 plus, ton plus, whatnot per round and just continuing to pile the pressure onto 46. you. It's a lot. Well, it's one of those stat lines that a lot of players pay attention to, and that is uh, troublous visits and how often you 45. have them. Because if you're hitting a big trouble every visit that you have, it's just going to continue to pressure your opponent. Yeah. That's better. 135. 135 from Stowe, but is it too late in this leg? 68 left. 18. Bullseye. Exactly where Leonard wants to be. Ooh, that one way out on for him. A rare... A rare big miss. 50. Is that 39? Yep. Leaves 37. Uh, nope, that 52. Yeah. Stowe, you require 114. So 114 left for Stowe. And again, this is one of those ton-plus checkouts that he needs to hit. Great first start. Tops. 
to break right back, and he Dane does so. Atta boy. In the fourth leg, three legs to one Leonard. Fifth leg, Stowe to throw first. A 21 dart break a throw is a gift. Yeah. Against Leonard Gates. Yeah, that's not a – you're probably not going to have that happen again. So now would be the time to uh, shape 99. Through. That might be the the checkout that he needs to that's, start building momentum. That spark, that, like you said, that, that little bit that lights you on fire. 59. And Gates with a softer first visit, so now is the time, Stowe. If you're going to do it, do it. What do you think came first, the shirt or the pants for Stowe? 100. For some reason, I just have a feeling it was the pants. I could see that. Like, I have this color pants. Can you make a jersey that represents that? Oh, Big yeah. 180 again from Leonard Gates, his third of the match. Yeah, because I think I don't think you go, hey, make a, you know, I'm going to go buy a, He already owned those pants. <laughs> he already owned those <laughs> pants. This is what I mean by Leonard's math starting to work. Yeah, he's 262, yep. start on the 18s. Yep. And like I said, he it's gotten phenomenally better, mm -hmm. but it's still I've still seen a few. Ninety five. Where we've been all of a sudden been like a whoopsie moment. We're like, oh yeah, it leaves you know, one sixty eight instead of a finish. We tried to leave double ten. That a seventy six scored. Ninety four. Great last start to leave tops. And Stowe. Not going to be able to check out the 164. 98. So he's got to hope for Gates' miss, or else Gates going to break the throw again of Stowe Bunce. That one's just below, and he did a little walk. That might. Nope. It doesn't affect anything. A 14 dart break a throw from Leonard Gates. That is how you react to someone breaking your throw. Yeah. Even after the soft first visit, came back with the 180 and just gas pedaled from there. So far, Stowe Bunce has not won a single leg 59. with the throw. That does not bode well as a stat line. This is a first to six legs in the quarterfinal of the Magic Darts Masters from A to Z Darts .com. 60. And you can find the new Red Panda design as well as the entire Fit Flight product line from our partners at Cosmo Darts at www.a-zdarts.com. One hundred and thirty four. Nice one three four. And Ryan, I don't know if you noticed this, but forty one. The championship dart circuit has a new sponsor. Our sponsor for this match is thirty two D C B D. Topicals, oils, and gummies delivering sleep aid and pain relief. Learn more at www.32dcbd.com. Use code CDC20 at checkout for 20% off on all purchases. And what a 180 there from Stowe Bunce. Responds nicely to leave the 127. But Leonard's going to get a look at the 170 finish. 95. But Stowe's going to expect to come back. 170. And he will. Yep. Ninety-six, Stowe. You're Great last start from Leonard. Yeah, but thirty-two for Stowe. I like to change the angle to find it. Game Hits it, dart number one breaks legs. again. Legs to We've had one hole to throw. Legs. I guess Stowe if you're gonna first. win legs against Le Leonard Gates, you're breaking him when you're doing it. Then you're, you're, <laughs> you're doing it. <laughs> you know much anything about Stowe's barrel? One hundred. That I do not. Okay. Just very interesting looking. And I'm pretty sure those are Leonard's 100. typical barrels that he's been using. I'm they just, guess the way more darts are going to be in processing still. Yeah, probably. They just looked a little different, kind of, to me. But, I mean, I could obviously be wrong. 43. Because 
Gates does a ridiculously long dart. 100. See the close-up there of those beauties. And Stowe only 24. So we're on pace for another break of throw. Right. 41. Well. But he gave that gift right back, didn't he? I don't think I've ever seen Stowe hit that many ones. 41. Yeah. But he's also given up the 19s, too. So I'm intrigued. As we look around at our other matches going on, 95. John Lidget has come all the way back to make it 5-5 five to five against Jake McMillan in the top 16 match. Ryan Vanderwhite, JT Davis getting started. Alex Bowman up 1-0 on Danny Lobby Jr. Average of 107.36 in the first leg. Holy Excuse cow. 97, correction. And both players... Well, yeah, yeah. Stowe was not on a bogey, but Leonard was. But Leonard will come back from whatever he sets up. 108. Same now 88 point. left. Correct. Uh, 100. I don't think Jeff was expecting that. Every time it's 122. 122 leaves 33, 43. Okay. Hey. I mean, he, he gets to come back to it, so it's not like it's a, it puts him in jeopardy, but there's a fair Daniel amount of Clark pressure 43. on it right there. It is a two-dark combination for Leonard. Three for tops or 11 for 32. It doesn't matter. He hits it. 17 dart break a throw. Eighth leg, Leonard to throw first. So Leonard will be throwing for the match, which it's just favor Stowe in this leg, <laughs> it seems that? like. Today, We've had anyway. one hole to throw through seven legs. 123. Why is it when he goes second, he does this to us? Whoa. Big 180 <laughs> from Stowe Bunce. <laughs> And you saw him smile and look to his right when it happened. 59. Oh. I bet both these players are wondering why they can't do this with their throw. Still right back into it. Big 140. He liked the feeling of that third dart, too. I think it just ticked off the other barrel and just barely nudged it. Way ahead. 100. Well, we called it advantage Stowe Bunce against the throw. <laughs> it's almost comical at this point. I mean, it's funny. 91. It's hilariously not funny, but funny. Like, it's just ironic. <laughs> Unfortunately, Stowe has to throw first in the next leg. <laughs> but look at that pressure from Leonard. Stowe, you require 90. A little bit of stage flex there from Leonard. See how Stowe goes about this? The right way. Double 15. Oh, no. It's the one. 78. Leonard, you require 80. Thing you can't really do there. Leonard will should get one look at tops for the match. And he hits it and holds his throw to win the match. A 6-2 to two victory for Leonard Gates. His first victory over Stowe Bunce in the CDC. Big win. That's a huge win. It's a big win. Because it also brings them a little bit closer to Stowe Bunce in the tour points list as well.